Hello, hello, I'm Karjan, and I'm going to play Bastion today. Um, I've played it, sort of. This is going to be a semi-blind run of it, because the extent of my playing was almost two and a half years ago, and I played for an hour and a half before some other things got in the way. Like life. Proper story is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. So. He gets up, <laughs> sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. So, yeah, okay. Um, narration aside. Um, I consider Bastion a really interesting game from what the little I've played it. Ground forms up under his feet as it point in the way. He don't stop to wonder why. I completely forgotten about the fact that it does that. Finds his lifelong friend just lying in the road. Well, it's a touching reunion. So, time to go destroying things, because I've got a hammer now. He sees what's left of the rippling walls, years of work undone in an instant, in the calamity. So, you can fall off these edges. It's not a good thing to do. At all. That a survivor? No, ma'am. It's a gas fella. Forced out from underground. Kid pops him good. <laughs> fella got a piece of him, though. I wonder if it says anything different if you don't get hurt. Destroy things, and grab things. I don't even know what I'm grabbing. I don't remember. Kid just rages for a while. <laughs> Kid just rages for a while. Well, yeah. Everything's destroyed around you. Oh. Hey, look, things. Try not to fall off any edges. Anything else? Anything else? Destroy the store. An old repeater falls out of the sky. Ain't a gift from the gods, but it'll have to do. <laughs> Ain't a gift from the gods. I love the narrator of this. Got a holder still to spin up the chamber. Um. Nothing. Mm. I guess I get infinite ammo. Sure looks like I get infinite ammo. Destroy things. What's over here? Nope. Nothing interesting. Kids worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Sometimes you just need a drink. Destroy the fountain of healing. Nope. A school of squirts tunnels up around them. Must have fled here from the mines. Squirt. 
Shots, huh? It's a wonder the old saloon's still standing. Used to have the nicest view. I kind of hope that eventually I get more shots with that. Because that empties depressingly quickly. Oh, what's this? Kid finds a memento from a girl he knew. Always use the fancier. Hey, spawn behind me. Well, since there's free healing right there, I might as well. Okay. Crystal barrette, a memento, fashion accessory, covered in soot, holds great value of the sentimental variety. Also her ha holds hair firmly in check. Best hang on to it just in case. City crest, a memento, an identification badge from the old days. All those on official business from the city bear the star of Caledonia. Calondia, Calondia. It is said to represent warmth, labor, and sacrifice. Uh-huh. He sets foot inside one of Selandia's famous Selandia. watering holes. Inside's old Rondi, the bartender. The calamity got him for his drinking did. Selandia. Okay, they're using the S sound. Then Kid finds his trusty shield. So much. The security takes him for a petty thief. Special delivery, gas fellas. Windbags start turning up for last call. Ow. Let's get out of the middle of that. out in front of the kid. What? Ow. Them windbags are playing for keeps. sees the weight of the bastion out the window. It's a bit of a drop. <laughs> bit of a drop, the the uh, teller says. Yeah, bit of Rondi a drop. Rondi always wanted his ashes scattered here. Whoops. I 
I don't know if I was supposed to do that. Okay. Little bit of an oopsie. Yeah, maybe I should use dodge. He gets a good look at things on his way down. <laughs> he lands on top of a breaker's bow, and it ain't broke. <laughs> So, that's great and all. Uh, something looks maybe? Nope. Okay. Kid spies a good perch for some target practice. Wasn't long before the kid could loose an arrow, strong and true. He knows he should draw the string all the way back. Thanks, snarky narrator dude, but I'm getting shot at, so... Another memento thing. Okay, trees? No, trees don't go away? Okay. The kid pockets a memento from a breaker, once the fastest man in the land. Something stringy. Upgrade material for the breaker's bow. Stretch of Mies Gut, prized by bowyers and pelt ball fans. One more reason for the popularity of Mies hunting. It is is a meese like a moose, except plural? Right back at ya. <laughs> yeah. Good news is the emergency defenses still work. Bad news is they aiming for the kid. fast learner. Black tonics. Okay. That doesn't sound suspicious in the slightest. Find the distillery, right next to the arsenal. Tough part of town. Okay, so apples apparently heal you. Hmm. Hmm. There's a way down there. The arsenal's where the kid can pick the best tools for the job. Ah. <sighs> Arsenal is where you can change your equipment. Okay. I don't really have anything interesting. Currently, the breaker bow is more useful. Um. Guess not. Okay. Yeah, I don't see any any other points where that could be. So one let's... sip of the spirits in that distillery, and the kid'll feel like a new man. Okay. Let's see. Squirt cider plus ten max health. 
Fermented squirt extract with a nose of stale bread and ocean water. Very nutritious. Dread rum. Plus 10% critical hit chance. Active only when at full health. Pungent concoction that calms senses and steadies nerves. Favored by the breakers and other fighting forces. Fetching fizz. Absorbs stray fragments. Started as a barroom prank, but evolved to become popular with miners and scrap board. Metallic aftertaste. Um... I don't think I'm going to be spending much time at full health, so Dread Rum is really not that useful to me. Um, more health or stray fragments? I'm gonna go with more health. Okay. Now I can go this way. Some yeah. of them squirts birthing like crazy in a couple of corn bins. Once taught the kid good manners. He never used them, though. <laughs> oh, I'm not entirely sure I should be killing those guys. And then he falls to his death. I'm just fooling. Yeah, see, you can accidentally fall off the edge of the world. And that was. Oh, Ferry Bard sends the kid on his way. The bastion's real close now. No. 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 painful, but only minorly. Come on. Yep. Gotcha. Okay, places I can't go. Doing a little bit of demolition work. Okay. Kid takes a chunk of alloy. Smell of barley and spoiled blueberries fills the air. Scumbags. Kid maybe shouldn't have done what he just did. Robs a scumbag of his last meal. That's not a good thing. Oh boy. You know, we're not going there. Running away. So I'm 
getting a little bit. Kid better watch his step. That's an edge. And I'm now out of Kid there. Put we go. Some out of his misery. Ugh. That was a little bit painful. I'm good at this game. I'm real good at this game. That kind of terrifies me accidentally walking over those edges like that. He finds okay. the core to the wharf district. Let's maybe go this way. Yeah, that's ow. Oopsies. Anything over here? Nope. Good to know that those holes are indeed holes. He steals the city's heart. Might as well. <laughs> get this feeling that feel like just gonna move run. on. The place is starting to fall. Interesting. Eh, sort of. Gotta keep moving. See that core kid took was the only thing making this particular rock stay afloat. Kid just keeps running. Now the kid sees something stranger still. His mind races. Pretty sure there was an actual end Did to Did anybody that. else survive? Okay. Just try not to... Sure enough, he finds another. He finds me. Oh. We talk for a spell. <laughs> City Crest. Asked about the seal representing the city of Celadonia. Weren't those only meant to be uniform and... There's a bit of the Bastion's power in that crest. Enough to point the way to the cores. Okay. Asked about the large bluish mineral found in the Dwarf District. It feels warm to the touch and hums like a motor. What exactly does it do? All I tell him is to set that core is on the monument there. Then watch. Okay. Ask about what happened to Nacy, the girl who used to pin her hair back with this. Is she here already? Where is everyone? I tried to let the kid down gently. This is the Bastion, all right. Except no one else showed up. Okay. Cute. And just like that, the Bastion comes alive. Starts growing again. Growing stronger. Kid's gotta put its power to good use. Now the Bastion can send him even farther into the wild unknown. Okay. That's, I'll admit, kind of cool, but... Kid ponders what to build. Okay. The only spirits permitted on the rippling walls were the kind that increased productivity. Okay. Stores weapons and secret skills. Well, let's put the distillery up first. Makes time to sample spirits from my personal supply. Let's see. Plus one chance to carry on if defeated. Damage surrounding foes if defeated. Dramatic beverage starts piping hot. According to folk tales, it almost wake the dead. 
wear whiskey. Plus 100% critical hit chance. Active only when below 33% health. Scentless yet very brisk beverage of boiled rattletail whisker. Used to revive patients in Trio Shintar. Cinderblock Stout. 33% speed while defending. Spicy, nutty flavors and dry aftertaste. Um. Okay. Hardy Punch might be useful. Also, wear whiskey. Because you've already seen my my habit of, of health. Um, let's just go with Hardy Punch. So you can change these at any point. For the most part. Just different Hardy slots. Hardy Punch is so zesty. It'll let you carry on through the worst of times. So yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Well, let's continue on. Kid don't know what's out there waiting for him. Okay, snarky narrator, why don't you tell me? The Skyway. Now the kid can ride the wind to distant lands. To harness the Bastion's power, seek out cores across the city and beyond. Okay. Breaker Barracks, Proving Ground. Here the Breakers once honed their skills and focused with their bows. In the Workman Ward, there's a core detected. What's this? Ah, that's the Wharf District. Okay. That's where I came from. Wow, big land. Okay. Well. Next time. <laughs> faceplant. I'm going to call the video here, and next time, I think we're going to go off to the Proving Grounds, so I can play with the bow some more, and try not to fail as hard with it. I will see you next time. Till then! <laughs>